Welcome back, Digitees, to the grand finale of Hades. That's right, yesterday I told you that I would not give you an episode unless it is us escaping out of here and finally beating our father instead of our father beating us. Look, I tried calling Child Protective Services on them, and it just does not work. They will not come down here. They're sorry we can't help you. So I've got to escape on my own, no matter how many tries that takes. I mean, honestly, how hard could it really be? But hey, if it takes multiple attempts, I'll make sure to give you guys at least the snippets of the dialogue that happens between me and Hades, you know, my dad, trying to get out of here. So that way you don't miss out on any story elements. All right, this is it. This cold white substance falling slowly from the heavens. Snow, they call it. Look carefully upon each fleck. Tiny crystals, but structurally weak. They melt. This surface realm, it is held up by mine. If you're quite finished teaching me about this snow phenomenon, can we get on with brutally trying to kill each other here? You wish to have your mortal colored blood spill once again upon this bed of snow, then fine. Let us proceed. Shall you make me do this? I'm here, Father. Come on. There was a time when Cerberus would never have permitted any soul to exit through that gateway there behind you. Oh, that can't possibly be true. What about Orpheus, Theseus, Heracles, Odysseus? Countless tales of brave men delving into the underworld, then leaving once they came. They left on my authority alone, nor did they take for granted my good graces. You believe you are entitled simply to walk out of here, from your birthright and your responsibilities. But I am here to tell you no. Ah, oh, damn it! Your flailing attempts against me are embarrassing. The final footage that you'll be seeing, you will know that I'm going to get all the way up to the top and we need to see exactly what is on the other side of getting past Hades. What happens when we finally beat our father? What happens when we escape? Are we going to be able to meet our mother? Honestly, I really do not know. So let's get started. I think I want to start off with the spear because honestly, the spear is going to be better for the audio quality in general. And what do I mean by that? Well, there is a lot of tippy tapping and a lot of heading around with this, you know, with a lot of these weapons. The the gauntlets you are smacking down on the on the mouse a lot. On the shield, you're kind of doing that a lot too. The spear you can play a little bit more range, a little bit more casual, a little bit more laid back in a sense. And I think I think this can be a little bit better so you guys just don't have to listen to all the the hard hits on the keyboard and stuff like that. So let's go ahead and get started and see exactly how far we can get because we're going all the way up to the top and nothing less. What is our first boon here? Okay. Here, let me show you. Oh, you're so sweet, Artemis. What kind of boons do we have here? Attack is stronger with a 15% chance for a critical. Your dash strike. I mean, I kind of want to do a dash strike plus 50% right off the bat because that's just already a 50% increase. And I do a lot of dash striking in general, especially with the spear. It has a really good kind of swinging ability there. Just out in a while, just a big old arcing AoE like kind of attack there. And we are also using the same... Uh, we are using the same, what do you call it, like amulet. We're seeing, using the same equipments from before, where we have a 6% chance of getting, just like that. Oh, we accidentally picked it up. We have a 6% chance of broken urns. Where is it? Yeah, a 6% chance for broken urns to contain healing items. And those healing items heal us by 10 pieces each. So it's a beautiful way to stay on top of your health, especially as you gain more through here. We have another one. Ooh. Oh, you're special. You're cast. I don't really want to do any cast, but you know, any damage you deal has a chance to be a critical, a 3% chance. I'll take that. But just a 3% chance base flower mat for anything to be a critical is pretty good in general, especially against bosses when you're going to be hitting them a lot. So you want to have any of those critical chances in general with a 200% increase to your damage when you do crit on them, which is pretty decent. It stacks up very well. But oh, I tell you what, this has already been a mouthful. <laughs> I, I'm, I got to be in some kind of special, special, some kind of special mood today to be just talking even faster than normal and even more. Well, I'm not going to say as fluent as normal because, uh, I'm already started over my words a couple of times already, so it is what it is. But you know, hey, it's been 
Uh, it's been a long week, you know, in general, and not just because like, oh, because life, but because I have been storyboarding the, uh, the, what do you call it? The music video. <laughs> What's that project I've been working on for a week again? Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah. The music video. Oh, yeah. So I have finally finished the storyboarding for the music video. So I have the final result of what all the scenes are going to look like. I have an idea of what, how I want to do all the scenes. I, I know all the transitions I'm going to be doing. I know all the, um, all come the zooms and then all the edits I'm trying to look for, what I'm going to be trying to insert in the future. Now, the only thing that is really going to be stopping me at this point to actually getting it completed is just getting enough hands on deck to help me out to make it because I am going to be asking the leader. She takes my orders well. One cannot blame her, for she'd have nothing to hunt if not for me. No, I'm not asking to meet her, but I try not to talk during the dialogue the best that I can. I, I, I seem to mess that up sometimes. Your boons become common, then gain rarity every three encounters. Oh, after you take damage, damage, and completely chill your... Excuse me? So, your boons become common, and then gain rarity every three encounters, and affects one per. But an encounter is just when you have to fight. I mean, getting that early on can be really good. That would mean that we could, like, upgrade the rarity of our base, like, boons, like, pretty quick, right? So, we're, like, our hunter dash. Uh, was it? No, not that one. The critical chance, the hunter dash, yeah, plus 50%. So I'm not really sure what it means when they go up in rarity, if that changes anything. But I suppose we'll see. Maybe it upgrades it almost, just gives it more of a modifier. We'll see. Who knows? And we'll just have to find out after three encounters, see what it upgrades. So this is going to be the first encounter. Let's try to remember that. Yeah, so the thing that is going to be stopping me on making the music video and actually finishing it is being able to get, you know, my real life friends to have enough time to actually come help me film some of it. Because you have to realize that this weekend, is Super Bowl weekend, so they can't do it this weekend. And also, I'm waiting for some equipment to come, and I'm still waiting for some other kind of like attributes and things that'll be arriving. Uh, do I want to do the well right now? Not really, not when we have a mini boss for Aries right there. That's gonna be a great boon for us to use. Uh, and that's not really anything here. We could get a fishing point, but we're here to win, we're not here to gain resources. We're gonna go for the mini boss of Aries for a good boon buff there. Um, so yeah, I need so it is gonna be the Super Bowl weekend, so we're not gonna have time to do it this weekend. And then next weekend, I think, is Valentine's Day, so people are going to be a little bit busy. So it's just, uh, you know, we got to... Oh, God, that just took 12 damage. <laughs> so, yeah, you just got to find time, I guess, now for everyone to kind of get together and do some of the shots that, you know, need uh, multiple hands on deck to do. Oh, come on, dash, dash. Oh, I don't know why. I was using my dashing ability and just would not go. Probably because I'm still trying to attack at the same time. I should have just let go of the, <laughs> let go of the mouse. <laughs> That's what you get. So look forward to the pain you shall inflict this time around. I'm trying, Aries. I'm trying. Ooh, your cast has a blade rift. After you take damage, inflict doom. After slaying a foe, your next attacker special deals more damage. I mean, I guess that's all right. That, that's okay. Your next attack or special deals more damage. That's like once in a while. Your cast doing a blade rift hurling ahead, though, seems a little bit better. Not gonna lie, because now look at this. Oh my god, you look at that AoE, just like 22 damage per second kind of attack right there. That is beautiful. Yeah. Okay, let's go get some gold. But yeah, so now I just need time for everyone to get together and do some of the shots. There are plenty of other shots that I can do on my own that I'm going to be getting throughout those weeks in general. But then, of course, again, I just, it's going to be hard to get the finished product. I know I made a community post saying I think the latest that it'd be coming out is like being like the 28th. But honest to God, it might be a little bit later than that because, you know, I asked them today when they have time. I know I probably should have done it sooner, but I asked them today when they might have time to do it. And uh, that's when they told me, like, oh, in a couple of weeks. And then, so basically, that would, we have to get it all done, like, in a couple of weeks on a Saturday. Then I would have to release it on a Sunday, get it all done in a single day. Which, you know, I probably could. You know, I honestly, we'll see. We'll see. I still might release it on the 28th. Depends on how uh, attacks and flick doom. Yes. Ooh, actually, saying a foe, you're next. No, I don't need that battle rage. I don't need that attacks and flick doom. A pop, pop, please. I always thought Olympians never consorted with Cathanic gods such as yourself. But it sounds like Hermes is a close colleague of yours. You wouldn't happen to know why he's helping me, would you? Very informative as always, Charon. Thank you uh, for your enlightenment. I meant you no offense. No offense, my man. So, okay, so the dash strike, the dash strike does more damage. It did go up to rare, and now it's doing 60%. So, yeah, it basically gets, like, a free upgrade when it goes up a rarity. So, yeah, sure, like, every three encounters, I get a free upgrade to one of my boons at random. Sure, why not? I'll take it. Ooh, and a quick fish on that one. Another hellfish. Yeah, okay, so I might be able to, so as I was saying, I might be able to, uh, might be able to finish it just in time for the 28th. But, you know, if I get everything done in my own personal side done early, 
then that just means I can probably start working on the other projects a little bit early too, right? If, so if I get everything that I can do done, and then I just have to wait for, you know, my friends to be able to have time to help me out, then at that point I can start working on the other projects. Because remember, I was originally, I mean, the plan was originally three weeks, one video a week, where one was going to be the music video, one was going to be a video essay, and then one is going to be a part four of the movie, which is going to be more of a combination of all the different parts. Ooh, do I want a double up or do I want a... I mean, honestly, upgrading your weapon itself is super, like, powerful, especially for the spear has some really good upgrades, but I think I want to go for the double boons. That seems... The double boons, I mean, it's hard to beat it, you know, especially with Ares being one of them. I mean, that's... I, I love it. Yeah, they're, they're both good boons to have in general. My special Flex Doom, no, after Death Defiance, deal more damage to that encounter. That can be good for bosses, because I am I have two Death Defiances now, so now I can die twice, technically three times. Well, tw I die twice, and you lose on the third. Your attack and special cast deal more damage. Yeah, I'll just do a base four man, 13% more damage. That seems good. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Artemis. Not my bad. This wouldn't be the first time I was wrong about someone. Oh, calm down. It was just one boon. It was one choice. It's fine, right? You can't be that mad. Ah, on to the spikes. I'm gonna end up doing more damage to myself than she is. <laughs> end up jumping on top of the traps. Ah, no, never mind. She definitely hit me once there. Stay out of the way of all their attacks. Maybe get out of the originating area. Okay, spawning area. Uh, get rid of all the dark wizards. Come on, come on, come on. Dodge all the giant circles at the same time. My God, there's a lot of them. Okay, one last enemy, one last enemy. And there we go. I mean, it's hard to beat two boons, you know? shot you for that stunt myself oh yeah well i mean I, i'm probably the first point away from mountaintop i'm actually underground right now so after you cast hit where oh i love the fire seeking arrow that's just 12 extra damage in general after you deal critical damage enemy nearby is marky yeah, i know i just the extra 12 damage of fire seeking is just really nice it's really gonna be hard to beat that and you know the darkness would be good if i was trying to save up resources but i gotta go with this guy because he gives us a boon if I may be so bold, your highness, I was wondering, what brings you back around this way again? Same story as last time? Look, I have to level with you, Sisyphus. I'm leaving the house. I've had quite enough. You understand, I'm sure. I'm going to the surface. Oh, that is quite an undertaking, Prince. If it wasn't you yourself proposing it, I'd like to call it madness, truth be told. Though, you're just mad enough to pull it off. Well, hey, I hope you make it. Good fortune out there. Thank you, Sisyphus. Honestly, much appreciated. So, I don't need darkness and I don't need healing. So, I will take the gold, please, and thank you. How much do you give to me? 110. That's not too bad. I could use a little healing. And look at that. Now, that's why I take this this equipment here. The one that has a 60%, a 6 chance for dropping healing items. Like... That's just basically permanent health. You know, I don't have to worry so much about getting as much health now because I know that I can just, you know, heal back up what I lose. And I am going to buy a Hermes boon, please. Hold your cast of fire rapid succession. I mean, okay, that seems kind of, you know, wasteful. After you're taking damage quickly, dash, recover some you lost. After you dash briefly, become sturdy and move 100% faster. Ooh, 30% less damage or recover 30% of my damage. Is that really the same? I mean, it's kind of the same in a way. I mean, after you dash, I mean, yeah, I suppose. And I like the moving move one, moving 100% faster as well, because I can remember a lot of times being chased down by chariots or even like the bull, like the minotaur. And I just like, I'm just running away like this. Just running like, no, <laughs> you know? So going on to Meg, is it going to be Meg? It is Meg. You've really done it, Zagreus. My sisters have returned. All three of us now share the same assignment. Is it wrong of me that I'm somewhat honored to have garnered the attention of the Erinyes? Oh, I would say it's very wrong of you indeed. Are you coming on to me? I think she's coming on to me. Honestly, like, the, the, ah, <laughs> apparently I'm, I'm just going on to her because I just straight just dashed straight into that. Oh my gosh, she's already on the final wave. Move around, move around. Lee, I should not be dodging back into that. <laughs> Try to dodge out of the way. Oh my God, I do so much damage. Holy crap, what's all that damage coming from? I mean, I know on my base format damage is all right, but like, I didn't think it was gonna be that high. Is it actually the, my cast? Is it doing that much damage? Oh, you know, it's stacking up pretty good on her. I mean, not, not a huge amount, but a pretty like, decent amount right there. Just watching her health just kind of deteriorate over time. Let me get rid of all of her projectiles. Move it out of the way. Okay, good. Let's see if I can stack up a little bit of health around here. Get my runes back. 
and then launch on top of her yeah yeah oh honestly that casting ability is really strong when he's stacking on top of her my god that was an easy dub against meg honestly almost making some good time here as well we've been recording yes. for I mean, I've been recording for 16 minutes of the episode. I don't know how long, but the run says it's only been going for six minutes. And I, because I've realized too, like the time doesn't change while you're just kind of casually walking around. It seems to change when you're actually in a fight. So heal 34. Yeah, I'd, I'd say she's having some difficulty. She's kind of like, you know, dead. So, you know, that's the thing. Um, insurance. I will take an infernal trove. Why not? Why not? We'll take an infernal trove next time. Was it worth 50 gold? Maybe, maybe not. The infernal trove can also give you gold, so maybe we'll just make some of our money back and more. Who knows? On to the second layer. What do we have here? I'm feeling really confident about this spear. I'm feeling good about it. Um, yeah, oh, I'll find some more gold right here. But you know, honestly, I'm excited for all the content that's gonna be coming out. So I'm glad that I have the storyboard finished now for the music video. I'm glad I was able to put everything that I've been envisioning down onto like down in a paper you know i mean basically like or rather put it down in document form <laughs> you know but i'm glad i was able to put everything i've been imagining and what i could imagine onto a piece of paper and ended up printing it out and trying to build an entire story out of what i was imagining because it's one thing to just have like a couple of like visions of like have you ever done the thing where like you hear a song and you envision like you were like maybe you were like at a show and tell and like you suddenly pulled out all these cool riffs of like a guitar and everyone loved you and everyone clapped and everyone ran away with you and you were super popular and everyone loved you all um, 50 i guess i'll take 50 gems why not hopefully i don't take any damage you know you always try to imagine yourself in the center of a concert when you, you hear some good song oh god that's a lot more than i thought jesus <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> you know but um it, you know you always trying to you envision those kind of fake scenarios sometimes and uh but it. It, it's one thing to envision it and like another thing to try to build an entire thing around it trying to build make sure it's all cohesive that can actually tell a story that because like what i'm trying to do what i was realizing i started out i had to rewrite part of it to start out with because i realized at the very start that i was just trying to come up with cool scenes to the video and i and I'm like had like a part of it through before i really got too far into it luckily i was like wait a second i'm supposed to be telling something here i'm not supposed to just be making a you know a cool something to look at i mean that's that's part of it of course but i'm also supposed i'm also supposed to be telling a story with this music video i'm also supposed to have a theme around it so i had to rewrite part of it not really rewrite it but like i mean yes re more or less rewrite i had to rethink of how i wanted to envision parts of it because i when i first saw it, i envisioned a lot of what i wanted and i had so many thoughts in my head and so many cool scenes but then i had to find a way to connect them all together so a long story short of saying keep an eye out for that i'm excited to show you guys what i can do honestly i have of course i have not done any of the editing yet so who knows i could have all this footage i could have all these ideas and it can turn out absolute crap but that is kind of the joy of this entire project to begin with that i want to find out what it is i can do better you know i'm not just on youtube to just record a brain some some easy gameplay upload it and call it good which you know i've been grateful that you guys kind of you know had hades win because that means uh Hades is very easy to record for. <laughs> you know, I'm glad that Hades won because Hades really is just kind of like a hit record, you know, play like, oh, you know, that was our run. You know, I could have themes around the runs, of course, but, you know, it for a first time look at it, it's a lot simpler, not going to lie. But that doesn't mean that it hasn't been without its issues because um, for some reason, so I'm frozen. Uh, I'm going to wait for that guy to land out. For some reason, Sony Vegas likes to do this thing where uh if you have a video that's like over 45 minutes long or so it seems most of the time uh it'll just like to freeze during the middle of its renders it'll just not render it'll go to like 36 percent like frame 46,149 and it'll freeze I'm like oh that's weird it froze let me try re-rendering it and it'll get frozen at the exact same frame again I'm like okay well why don't i just try rendering that one part separately nope doesn't matter doesn't doesn't change it you if you re if you render a part for too long it'll just freeze like okay so i that was like 36 percent. let me render the first like 10 minutes including that part okay cool uh what do we have here for boon here before i rant on a little bit further the irony must not escape him for he long ago stood by my side against the titans with that thing in hand oh so it's even more fitting that i'm going to take him out with his own spear <laughs> Oh, no, that now is calling out to us. Now we know something about that. We, we now we know we got the victory. After you take damage, you both struck by lightning. After you dash before getting hit. Oh, you know what? I kind of like the bolt with after with my dash because I dash around so much. That's just again more free damage, especially like when I'm not even you know 
if I'm just trying to dodge, that's still doing damage even when I'm just trying to dodge. But uh, what was I just thinking about? What was I just talking about? Um, music video, uh, uh, crap. What was I just, oh, dang my ADHD brain, no. <laughs> I've completely forgotten. What was I just talking about? Hang on, I've got this. I know I'm a good YouTuber, but I'm also half distracted trying to take these guys out. And also, I'm doing a lot of damage. Holy crap, that is, that is doing quite a bit. Uh, you know, it's just gonna have to come back to me. What was I even talking about? Uh, stories. Oh, right. I mean, in general, I'm trying to improve myself. I, I make content not because, you know, just because, oh, that's right, Hades. Hades is easy enough to make content for. It's been fun enough, you know, it's, it's simple. But I do like to challenge myself with some videos. I like to, I, I almost like to, on the daily videos, I mostly enjoy to not edit as much as I can because it's daily. I do work a full-time job. It's, it's tiring, but I still enjoy it. It's, you know, but I'm not going to lie. It's tiring, but you know, I still enjoy it. So, <laughs> you know, you always, I always try to put in that part because it always sounds like you're like so complaining. Oh, why? I have to make videos every day. Poor me, my life. If only I could only choose to tell myself to stop, Mwah. you know, but like, I still like doing it, but uh, that's why I don't necessarily like editing as much. Hi, Hermes. <laughs> nice to see you. Please have noticed it doesn't count against you when we stop to have these chats. And says, yeah, I, I saw that uh, the, the timer does not count down when, you know, when we're talking. Do I want a third dash? Yeah, I kind of want a third dash. But whenever you hit a 10% chance to just not take damage, I think it's going to be a little bit better. Who knows, even if it, that one hit could be the one that makes me survive, you know, overall. And we're about to go into a merchant. I have 280 gold. Nice. Um, but yeah, so I'm trying to improve it all. I, I On my daily videos, I don't really necessarily like to edit as much just because they are the daily and it's a little, little bit time consuming. It depends on the video too. It just depends on the concept. It depends on what game we're playing. It depends on just what we're doing. Uh, what are we? Ooh, nice. And we'll have enough for the health afterwards. I hope not. Uh, that would mean that hell is frozen over. I wonder if you cast damage foes around you and inflict chill. Okay, when you have no runes, take less damage and deal more. I mean, that's kind of good considering the fact that I like to throw out my rune or my crystals. That That's just going to be 10% more damage and reduction. So that's pretty good. Uh, Charon, anything to say? No, nope, just a grunt. I love you too. <laughs> but you know, in terms of like when it comes to my special projects, of course, that's when I want to show everything that I can possibly do. You know, the... the Ooh, we got the high dragon. Please don't be nice, Mr. Hydra. But you know, that's why I like it when I do have these special projects and ideas in mind that I can show what I really want to do because most of the time I don't show what I can really do, you know? I remember back when I used to edit my daily videos a lot, lot more. I think it was like my Poly Bridge kind of episodes. In the Poly Bridge episodes, I did a lot of editing on. There was lots of memes, lots of jokes, lots of like inserted, you know, gags and zoom effects and stuff like that. And the videos did all right you know they got some attention they did pretty decent but uh, i couldn't continue that series in general because it was too difficult <laughs> it was honestly just too difficult but um you know i i enjoyed that series but there was a lot of editing and those videos you know it'd be like uh i would have to sit down and record for basically the better part of a couple of hours just to get the objective complete right because it'd be i was trying to get in the top like 100 or like beat real civil engineer and beat aliens rock you know, originally in Polybridge, but they're like legends at the game. Like they're in the top leaderboards and I never played any of the Polybridge's Polybridge games at all before. So me trying to get into that uh, atmosphere of trying to beat them was just not becoming possible. I did actually end up beating them a couple of times on a couple maps, not going to lie. But those episodes and stuff were like, I'd be sitting there micro tweaking the bridges for hours, for hours. I would spend like two or three hours on just recording in general, trying to just, you know, get that perfect moment. And I'd sit there and I would, I would mess with it for like, you know, like an hour or two. And I think I finally got it. Then I have to come back to it and be like, okay, so it finally worked. <laughs> build up the energy, build up the energy again. Okay, guys, I think we finally got it. Take a look at this bridge. Oh my God, it still didn't work. No, you know, <laughs> you know, you gotta play it up a little bit. Oh, there's a fishing spot right here. Can't do that wall off. What well, we got? L Lenanian Bone Hydra? <laughs> That's his name? I think you can get a backstab effect on this guy. Oh god, oh god, a lot of projectiles. I'm doing really well on trying to dodge all the shots. Where are my other runes? There are my other runes. Thank you. Go ahead and just launch these out. Why don't I? He's probably about to slam on top of me. Oh, yep. Yep, he did a lunge. Move it out of the way. And there we go. Oh, fantastic. That is, that is doing good already through the second stage and we still have basically all of our health right now we are doing real good 
120 darkness for that. And a fishing spot. Let's go ahead and fish real quick. Maybe a lava slug? Crustacean. Ah, I tried. <laughs> Uh, but what was, God, I, I've already forgot what I was talking about again, but, uh, the point is that actually, I don't know what the point is. Um, I like, I like making videos. <laughs> I like making videos. <laughs> I was going to like, where's that thought process going to go after that? I'm like, I, I think I was still talking about the fact of me making videos and like the, the concept of editing, but I think I interjected it a little bit in there for a little while about something else. I've already completely forgotten about it. Uh, I don't need any extra health regeneration. We're just gonna keep on going on through. My mind is all over the place. It is Friday. That's I've come home. Enough. It is ninth weekend. You know, I'm, I'm excited because after this, I guarantee you, I'm gonna have a little bit of that devil's juice. <laughs> you, know, you know, enjoy myself. It's gonna be the Super Bowl weekend. You know, a lot going on. Uh, I'm trying to get some new windows. I know. Wait, hang on, riveting. Don't click off the video yet. <laughs> riveting conversation. <laughs> Like, yeah, okay, so I got some windows. Uh, do you want to talk about taxes next? I mean, honestly, the taxes this year are just absolutely... No, no, don't click off. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. We're still continuing. We're going on to Aries here. We are in the final level and actually only been recording for 27 minutes. Oh, my. Uh, dodge, 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 dodge. Oh, I was trying to dodge that arrow, like, dodge and just make sure I was doing my evasion move through it the best that I can because those things do a lot of damage if they run into you. So I want to make sure that I don't do that. Okay, I'll go ahead and take out these ranged units first because I really hate them and they still managed to hit me. I could have swore I moved out of the way when he started firing. See one of the archers that fire like three in a row. Is that what got me? Um, do we want to kind of, you know, he hasn't gotten an abrosia in a while. You know, hey, Ares, you want an abrosia? Maybe you'll up our boon Ares, stance? I honor you for all the strength you've given me to overcome my foes. Honestly, like, you are probably one of my more favorite ones to get. Such a splendid offering to me. How very thoughtful there, my kin. I am taken aback, though I accept. Ah, that's very good of you. Very kind. Um, yeah, accept. This, I accept this message. Your special, after selling for your next attack, deals more damage. Your doom effect deals more damage when applied multiple times. Bonus damage per stack. Hang on, so I'm going to take that, first of all, because I already know that's going to be a great combination. Where is it? So, 12 damage per stack. So where is my doom effects in here regardless? Where is it? Where is it? It is got to be one of these. Me like the last one I'm looking at. My attacks will look doom. Okay. So after a brief moment, I think it's like after like a period of like three seconds, it hovers above like some, maybe like two seconds. So if I get like multiple hits in, it's just me stacking on top of that 50. So I can probably be doing like 80 like per like doom hit. Not bad. We'll go into the weapon upgrade next because honestly, these are all, it's, it's hard to turn these down. We did turn one down earlier, but that's because we had a double boon option as the door. But yeah, look at, okay, I want to see how much of this stacks up on top of it. I'm trying to watch the numbers and not get hit. <laughs> that did, um, yeah, that did like 118 damage with that stack there. I was watching. It went from like 318 to like, what was it, like 417 or something like that. Trying to watch the numbers the best that I can, but not working out so well. Take out the chariots because those things really like to just chase you down. I do not like them. Should be one more wave. No, just one more enemy. These are actually pretty effective getting behind the shield and still doing damage. Oh, I almost got stabbed by that trap. What do we have here? Spin attack charges up and recovers faster. Your attack is strike rapidly, but you cannot spin attack. And your special does 50% damage and 50% critical chance on recovery. I mean, I kind of like the hold attack to strike rapidly. Yeah, you can just kind of sit there and just... If I, if, oh, if I just hold this down, I can just kind of like... I can just dash around without having to click down now. I can just hold the button. <laughs> I can just hold the button. I mean, the, the dash strike is still going to be good, though. So uh, let's go for the double boom. Ooh, that's going to be nice because honestly, I always lose the most health on this floor when it comes to the very final boss battle. One, because sometimes to shield people, but mostly because of the final boss battle. And uh, yeah, I get hit a lot. So if I can get more powerful to take them out quicker, that's going to be amazing. Do I want lightning effects? They get stunned when they get jolted. Your call makes lightning rapidly strike nearby foes. I kind of want to do the jolted because getting them stunned is going to be good. I'm not sure if it stuns bosses, though. Is that what you think? I know this is like the second time today I've done this to you. Just calm down. The other people's boons are better. Maybe get some better, you know, buffs. <laughs> Why don't you? I will not endure, and I went directly into that arrow. I saw it happening. I could not stop myself. <laughs> I could not stop myself as the arrows come along. We'll try to dodge all that. There's a lot of things on the ground that are trying to hit me. Please blow up. Please blow up. Ow. <laughs> not on me. <laughs> not on me. No, not in the arrow. Not. Ow. What just hit me? Did I run into the arrow? I don't think I did. 
I looked away for half a second. <laughs> Almost got hit by another arrow. These things are all over the place. My God, they're they're firing like all four cardinal directions. How do I uh, try to dodge all this and talk at the same time is not working. Where's the last one? There you are. There you are. Die for me. Oh, dear God. Almost half my health. Oh, you're still there, I see. Well, then, all right. Let's call it even for the moment and get on with this. Arnett, I'm sorry. I can tell you she's mad at me. She's, she's real mad at me. <laughs> Your crit effects deal, what, 15% extra more damage on top of a 200%? No, I'm gonna... I'm gonna go ahead and get them marked. After you deal critical damage to a foe, a foe nearby is marked for a 30% increased chance. Yeah, that seems a lot better in general. A 30% increased chance to get more criticals. Ooh, do I wanna, I, do I wanna go Zeus or do I wanna go, I kinda wanna go for the weapon upgrade. I kinda wanna go for the upgrade, but the mini boss reward would be amazing for Zeus. I bet it'd be something like the call effect. Yeah. Okay, are there any urns around here that I haven't broke? Yeah, <laughs> that can give me health right there. There's 10 health. This is a big location. I'm sure there's some extra urns. Any extra? Okay, a few there on the side. Any other chance? No, that's all of them. It's probably gonna be the Minotaur. Is it gonna be the Minotaur? Mini Tartar? It's the Mini Tartar. <laughs> we meet again, short one, for further battle. A short one? That's a low blow, sir. I thought you were the big honorable type. There are a lot of puns going on here. You mock my sense of honor. Common tactic. Now prepare. At, at first, I thought he said you mocked my sense of humor, which I'm, that's still on par too, because you guys are just making bad puns. Like, oh, that's a low blow because I'm a short guy and he's a bit, he's a, well, I guess Zagreus is probably the pun guy. Anyway, the music is kicking in. Let's get started. And rift. And try to be conscientious of his attacks. Let's just not, let's just not swing around randomly. Keep a good idea of where he is at all times. He's going to jump at me. Yep. Lay off my rift. Lay off another one. Low, take out of the way. I almost, I accidentally dodged into the pillar there a little bit. He's standing still. Dodge out of the way. He's going to jump at me. And he kind of got stuck. Ah, he got stuck in the pillar and then hits me. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, he's, he's running. Oh, he got stuck against the wall. Nice, nice. Ooh, near miss, I'd say. Okay, impervious for a moment. He's going to run at me. No, no, he's just going to, he's just going to swing at me. And still take a good shot at me. Okay, I just got to get him down to like a quarter health and then he quits, right? I, don't, I, I think, I hope so. Throw my rifts at him. Do lots of damage. Keep my distance. He's standing still for a second. Ooh, no, 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 no. Oh, oh. Can I hit him? With me, short one. I'm glad we've made a habit of it thus. I don't know if I, if I took him up before he hit me. Oh, God. <laughs> what was that? I'm like oh mid lunge right now. There we go. I oh, I'm at 81. I think I did. I think I did hit him. Managed before <laughs> before uh before he managed to hit me because otherwise I'd be real low. Oh hell yeah. Hades. In the name of Hades, I accept this message. Uh, I don't want a special. I don't want that call. I mean, okay, was it really worth it? After you take damage, you're both struck by lightning. It really wasn't all that worth it. Not gonna lie, but I will take Zeus's A because that can be some good stackable damage in general on top of the boss, on top of Hades, on top of my father. You know, my father that I need to the beat. For a fountain chamber in this area. Oh yes, get some free health. Oh look at that, and I'm back up to full health. Oh that is. Could you ask for a better moment? Oh hello, there's some dialogue. Within the delicately hewn constructions of Elysium exist places of peace so utterly serene and absolute as mortal kind is seldom to experience during the average short and often painful coil. Gotta say, my man, you've got yourself one hell of a voice. Let's sweet but butterly smooth. Within the delicate hue constructions of Elysium exist places of peace so utterly serene. Honestly, the way he just says it and construes really all the words together, mortal kind. it really gets my jimmies all ruffled. <laughs> I can say that my jimmies are thoroughly ruffled. Like, if there was at least one jimmy that I knew, he's gonna be texting me any moment and be like, Yo, I'm all ruffled right now. What have you done? Like, I, would you like to know? Because I have a sweet man talking in my ear and I leave me alone. Leave me alone, Jesus. <laughs> Got lots of enemies coming after me. <laughs> ah, no, no, the chariot. <laughs> Try to dodge it the best that I can. I'm glad I took that movement speed bonus because I was just barely out of reach of that chariot. <laughs> I think it was on my ass real hard. Oh my God, out of the way of the arrow. Why don't we take out the ghost boy? 
who is still alive stop it i'm gonna just go ahead and activate my call and ability right now take out these guys well i have the chance none of them have armor on activate it again do lots of damage to everybody standing around and do it one last time and he should be they did they did these french what they did anything else around here we don't need any of the food there is a shop Shop anything yeah. good 50 percent to armor for 65 yeah you know why not for six encounters that might be worth it i mean we're not gonna need it immediately but uh it's something i will take the extra health though uh because simply i don't know we're almost at 200 and we have when you come back from death defiance you come back with 50 percent of your health so honestly the more health we have the more health we're just gonna have also when we come back in general when we die inevitably against our father a couple of times probably hopefully i mean I'm, hey we might get a perfect run who knows i've been doing pretty good and playing slow against these uh against these bosses in general but we'll see how well that goes in the next in the next boss room against um what's his name against the minotaur and uh uh, the instance of the instance of Theodore? I don't know. I think it starts with a T and an H. There's also some explosive cart boys coming after me. Oh, God. I took a little bit of a hit there. Activate my call. Take out these guys in the area. Take out this stupid archer. Why don't we? Yes, please. Uh, dodge your whatever that is. Get that going. And you know what? I forgot. I can just hold my attack button. I can just hold the attack button. <laughs> Max life plus 25. I'm gonna go for the boon, I think, this time. I could go for another, you know, bit of health, but ah, uh, you know, whatever. I think I'm gonna want the chill effect because I do like the chill in general. I mean, it's, it's a good boon, especially when you can slow down the movement, attack speed, and everything of an enemy. And I think her, not Aphrodite, what's her, I think her name also starts with an A, like the, the cold lady. We're, well, I mean, we're about to find out because we're about to come into the dialogue. Do not at me about my pronunciations nor inability to remember any of their names. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, even though I've been playing this game a lot, I'm not very good with names at all. No joke, when I started my new job, it took me the better part of like four months just to learn two people's names. I, you know, it's it's a curse. It's a curse. You know, like you, you always hear that thing like when you like have a like, teacher. It's like, oh, I'm really bad at, read, at knowing names. So I'll, I'm going to just take a while to get used to it. And somehow they learn like all like 90 students' that. names in like, like one month. No, it took me several months to learn like two people's names. I'm still trying to learn people's names <laughs> that I interact with every single day. Any health effects are more potent and also restore 96 now. Jesus, I uh, special. I don't use the special. Whenever you cast, damage falls around you and flick chill. I mean, I don't know. I don't really use. I mean, I do cast a lot, but like around me, it seems like a weird. I thought I'd just have like more health. Bonus restoration. Well, I guess that's just healing though, right? That's not. That's just healing effects. Okay, fine. I'll do the area damage, I suppose. I was hoping for something a lot better. Not gonna lie, but uh. You know, it is what it is. Any gold urns around here that I'm missing? Not that I'm seeing. Uh, otherwise, leave a comment down below on all of the gold urns that I've been missing this entire time. I will take the merchant because I think I'll probably be able to buy two things with my money. I have lots of money and I heard a little ding. Ooh, okay. So you're special. When all foes are chilled affected, they're 10% slower and decay. But I don't really have anything that gives them chill except my casting capabilities. So, yes, that's just going to be something. And we get to buy the health as well. Nothing to say, Karen. Okay, fair enough. Where is that fishing spot? There you are. Be very, very careful. I am hunting fish. Remember how in the middle of the video not too long ago, I was completely rambling about about something that I forgot about several times in a row? Yeah, I still don't remember what that was, but I'm glad that we're right back on track again with just talking wildly and playing Hades. <laughs> what was your name again? Theosis. plainly see, monster, as has Asterius. And this time, we are filled with renewed vigor to destroy you utterly. Destroy you utterly. So we're locked in an endless cycle of violence, basically. I guess that's one way for you to pass the time here in this stodgy place. Yeah, I mean, honestly, there's probably not, not else a whole lot else to do except fight each other. You take that back about Elysium. Or better, I shall make you eat those careless, inappropriate remarks. Come, Asterius, to war! War. But although, and look at that, the Minotaur's health is actually down a little bit because we did fight him earlier as a as a mini boss room. I'm gonna focus. Ow, what? Oh, come on, he's facing towards me. He should have just struck that way. He did a 180 effect. I oh oh come on, come on. Never, yeah, that's right. You're supposed to be running into the wall for me, please, good sir. Go ahead and just throw my cast now because he's gonna come out of that vulnerability mode. Yep, yep, yep. Barely dodged. Barely dodged the range attacks. I gotta keep an eye on those because he is still aiming me down. Dodge that, why don't I? Minotaur is getting close. Dodge that. Gone, 
Um, where are my stones? There are my stones. Where are you, Mini Tartar? There you are. Go ahead and just throw my cast. Oh, they're bouncing off the pillars. Come on now. <laughs> Come on now. Uh, he's about to swing at me. Dodge out of the way. I got a near miss there. Go ahead and throw my casting. He hit the wall. Yeah, he's done for. He's done for. Minotaur is dead. Yeah. Okay. Ow. Oh, come on. What? That pillar didn't dodge? That, that, or that pillar didn't... <laughs> not the pillar didn't dodge. The pillar didn't block his attack. Excuse me? It's supposed to. It's so it blocked that attack. I see how it is. I see how it is. Okay. Okay. Y you just pick and choose the ones, huh? <laughs> dodge. No, how's that not dodging? And being so careful about this too. Okay. Okay. Spend my time. Okay. That blocks it. Keep my distance. Just hit him. Beautiful. Okay. Now he's going to activate. I'm going to do my call ability now. Just do as much damage as I can in the area. Being near him. Do as much as I can. AOE, DPS, all this fun stuff. As much as I can. Yeah, baby. Ooh. Oh, that stacked up a lot of damage on it. We are doing good, Digidees. I think this actually is going to be the run. And well, we know. Oh, hater, my shade. My greatest fan. My greatest fan. Ah, uh, yes. My one fan in the stands. I love you, good old shade. I love you. Probably my one and only supporter that I'll ever have. Don't make me come up there, boy. My father. Just after I got done saying I got my one and only fan and then my dad comes in. He's like, don't let, don't make me come up there and beat your ass. <laughs> this is basically what he's saying. Like, don't make me any more angry than I have to. I'll come up there and beat you. Like, I'm sorry. Um, traps, specials. No, nope, don't need any of that fun stuff. We are moving on to the final rounds of this run. Uh, you know, these runs do take a better part of about an hour. You know, I thought we were making some great time earlier, which we were. But we're already at 42 minutes of recording. So you for you guys, maybe like 41 minutes. Uh, well, I did add in some extra scenes, I think. Uh, I definitely added in some extra scenes in between of like the failed pass attempts. So, uh, so yeah, probably about 42 minutes for you guys from that extra dialogue. And uh, go ahead and move on through. So, yeah, about an hour for each one. It also depends on just, uh, I mean, am I going to get it on the first try here? The hewn network of tunnels grows from one of the cold temple's flanks containing vicious denizens unwelcome in this realm even in death i'm gonna start with the weapon upgrade choice i'm gonna go ahead and along with this side because i'm kind of looking for a three prong attack with this weapon I, I know it has the ability to upgrade for it. i'm just gonna go ahead and see here and just hold my attack button <laughs> just let it do its job just let it, just let it do its, its, its rapid attack so i would just sit here and just go yep i can just sit here and just hold the button and it'll do that for me is that gonna win yeah that does it <laughs> that's so much easier I'm just skating through this at the speed of sound. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, take them all out, take them all out. And I'm just gonna sit here and hold down the attack. Beautiful. Hey, wait a second. I remembered. What happened to that thing where it was uh, upgrading our boons? That, that's a heroic dash strike plus 80%. Yes, yeah, upgrading the rarity to all of them. Remember, it's one, it's upgrading one boon like every three encounters. And these rooms, every single one of these rooms count as an encounter as well. So that's stacking up really nice for that right now. So honestly, going through as many of these rooms as we can will continue to give us lots of upgrades. So almost every single three rooms, we are getting a upgrade to one of our boons, which is just free, free damage, free everything. Dodge out of the way of all those giant blades of death. There are lots of rats all around. Why are there so many rats? <laughs> they put me in a room, a rubber room, rubber room full of rats. Uh, rats make me crazy. Crazy? I was crazy once. They locked me in a room, a rubber room. Rubber room full of rats. The rats make me crazy. Crazy. Ah. <laughs> cast, cast, cast. Oh, why are you bouncing to the right? How are you managing to do that? Stop it. Stop it. Let me survive. Oh, God. Ah. There's lots of explosions going on. Ah. Not the rats. Let me get. I'm poisoned. Okay. Okay. Good. Block all that. Kill him. Beautiful. Uh, where is the exterminator when you need him? Jesus. Okay. What, what, what poison? I didn't land in any poison. Take this guy out, please. Why don't we? Oh, God, that was an adventure. <laughs> that was an adventure. Your dash strike hits three times where your dash has minus 25% range. I actually want that because the less range, the better. I, I honestly think that the, uh, I honestly think that the dash is a little bit too far. So a shorter range, especially with having three dashes. I mean, yeah, yeah, I have three dashes, right? No, like one, two, three. No, one, two. Oh, I, that's right. I didn't get the, I didn't get the, uh, what do you call it? The, uh, Hermes. Hermes? Yeah, yeah, I didn't get the Hermes upgrade for an additional dash. I would like to get that if I could. There is an upgrade right there for him. That's 500 gold. Jesus Christ, that is a lot of gold. Uh, well, I guess let's go towards... I mean, let's go towards the health room? 
mean, yeah, let's see if we can get ourselves even more health. Again, because, you know, when we come back with health defiance, we have 50% of our health. So if we can just go ahead and get another boon to our health here on a boss level as well, it's just going to be easier to kill this guy. Yeah, there we go. On a boss level as well, because that means it's going to give us 50 health for this one. So we're going to be stacked up on HP. That is, of course, if we even have to fight for it, too. It could be the one that has the Seder Sack in it, so we may not even have to worry about it that much. Get a whole bunch of health and then heal up, be golden. I mean, it might be better still to go through a lot of these, though. As I was saying earlier, simply because we do have boons being upgraded every three encounters. Don't you dare poison me. These guys are actually starting to survive for quite a while. Well, keep on moving through. Do we see a Seder Sack? No, not yet. Maybe next room? Next room, we'll find out. Ooh, wow, we just steamrolled through that one. Keep on moving. Come on, what do we got? What do we got? Yeah, there we go. You know that? Yeah, plus 50, right? 260 health. Oh my god. And plus restore that. Yeah, 250, 270 gold. Okay, let's go see what we can buy. Can we get any of the upgrades? Ooh, we can get. We're gonna be just short of being able to do. I okay. You know, I think I want to do one more room then. I, I kind of want to do one more direction, and with that, I'm going to do the upgrade room. It is going to be a mini boss, so this could be a huge mistake. I could just be losing extra health for absolutely no particular reason other than the guides of being able to do more. This is only going to be effective if... Oh, I just realized I missed a gold urn down there. This is only going to be effective if I can try to not take any damage at all, because otherwise it's going to be a little bit null and void, the fact that I even did this. Uh, I could, no, restore 33, no, no, none of that's good. I was going to say maybe I could take one that restores health automatically going into the next chambers or like some extra health or something like that, but no, nothing of the sort. Go ahead and activate my cast. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. Yep. No, there, there, there is the damage. There's the damage. There's the damage. Oh boy. I, I threw my cast, but it's, it's close enough. Yeah. Look, it's getting stuck. <laughs> it's too big. It's getting stuck against all the edges. Okay. Well, we got to keep an eye out for any urns then. Gotta heal back a little bit here or something because we cannot be taking this damage at all. Throw those rifts out. I'm just gonna hold down the attack. No, I'm gonna dodge through the blades. There we go. Near miss. Whew, that was a close one. Any urns with health? No, but we are healing back a little bit each chamber we go through by three. Oh, there is the boss. Okay, okay. Throw the. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> That's a big explosion. Big explosion. Oh god, okay, we got lasers. We got a big explosion that's gonna hurt me. <laughs> that is gonna hurt me. I saw that and I'm like, ah, I can't dodge it. There was no way I was gonna be able to dodge that. That encompassed like the entire map. I'm not really sure what else they expect me to do. <laughs> well, that was not too bad of a boss, but we did take some damage there, which is a little upsetting. Do I want a critical chance increase? I mean, uh, I kinda do, I, I kinda do to do but i think that i think doing more damage with the blade rift is going to do more in general just being how many times i'm gonna be able to throw that it doesn't seem like i'm gonna be able to get any extra health off of those urns nope all right let's keep on moving through we got enough gold i would really like to get that hermes upgrade though should i go through one more tunnel i mean i only took that damage because it was kind of like the boss room right i mean if i go through another tunnel then i probably will heal back more than i lose right what could go wrong? What if I find another shop in there where I can just restore my health anyway? Yeah, you know what? Let's go through one more room. I know you guys are trying to wait for the, you know, that final boss battle, but you know, hey, I, I think I think this, this is going to be better for us. This will help us get more damage, more upgrades, because this is also an Aries one, and we're going to do our best not to take any damage. <laughs> not take any damage. I'm saying at 230, 233, we're getting it back. We're getting it back slowly not not very quickly but you know that that is what slowly means um and we're doing good we just need some health to maybe drop out of one of these urns and we should be golden uh we're healing back a little bit not too worried honestly like the fact that we even got that plus 50 health to begin with so we were at 210 so if we are above 210 we still got a plus in my in my eyes i mean that could just be me making excuses for myself preemptively but uh i, I think in still the end it's still a benefit right i mean look there is that uh there, there is that shop I was talking about. You know, actually, hang on a second. Game 25 without restoring. So that'll put me at, five, at 433. Damage to armor, striking undamaged foes. No, I would really like to get that plus 25 without restoring any, but that's going to put me below the 500 mark, and I'm saving up the 500 to get the Hermes upgrade because they might have the option for another dash. Oh, come on, heal back. Heal, yeah, get that, get that cure right there immediately. 
I'm surprised he even managed to hit me through all those shots. Oh, dodge, 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 dodge. Near miss. Yep, that's fine. That's fine. Get all the doom effects on this guy. Stack him up. Where is he going to be landing? There is no more. There is some more. Okay. Throw my rift at this guy. It's stacking up a lot on him. Beautiful. Nice. Okay, where is the other guy? He's going to be dropping it out of here somewhere. It's a big old rat. A, ooh, a rat. Ah, explosions. Ah. <laughs> okay, you know, yeah, greater call. Greater call time. I need to start doing some area damage around with this. Take out the guys that can do poison to me. Take out the rats. Please. I'm just going to sit here and just uh, hold the attack button. Just hold attack. Ugh. Okay. Well, your special inflicts doom. You have to slay a foe. Your next attack is special. You, you after death defies. You deal more damage to that encounter. I think, yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and do that because that's just a 15% increase to our damage in general because we are likely about to go down at least a couple of times. We're at 576 and that is the goal that we got. 223. So we are, we did take a little bit of damage still, but I think we'll be fine. Hermes, give me those dashes. Oh my God. Plus two? Plus two dashes? Oh. <laughs> Look at that dash. I can just dash everywhere. Well, I'm going to be slamming down on this keyboard as much as I can. I don't even care. Oh, should I go? I kind of want to go for the gold. I kind of want to go for... I, I'm going for it. I'm sorry, DigiDs. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But I need... I want to see if I can get more health back. I don't want to be going into this a little bit low on my health. And it just means more upgrades. Remember, we keep getting the rarity upgraded on some of these, which just means more damage. And plus, we're also going to be getting gold with this. We can maybe afford another upgrade on top of it. So we have to just absolutely make 100% certain that we are going to win this battle. Because I tell you what, you know, as much as I love making content, I also don't love sitting here for like, you know, like four hours straight trying to get the winning, <laughs> trying to get the winning run. I love making content, but at some point, I, at some point, I got to make absolutely certain that I will win this, <laughs> you know, even if it means really hunkering down, being true to myself, I'm like, all right, stop being so wild with your movements and just win, just win. It's just that simple. Just win. You know, it's, I mean, you look, you look at a game and you're like, okay, how do I win? Well, the answer is, well, you just win. I mean, it's, it's, it's so simple, right? I can't believe no one ever thought of this before. And oh my God, actually doing a lot of damage to those rats. Holy crap. Those guys went down fast. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and activate these axes. Dang it, I couldn't hit him. Oh, come on. Th those rocks are blocking my shot. Okay, I'll just sit here. Just throw my punches. Let the fire-seeking arrows do their job. These guys are coming down and dropping into the area. Just keep on, just, I'm just going to keep on throwing my attacks. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, uh, where are my, where are my crystals? There's my crystals. Thank you very much. There you are, you little rat bastard. Quite literally, a rat bastard. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, now this. I'm glad we did this. I'm so glad that we did this. Throw my rift out on this guy. Use my greater call. Take out everybody in the area. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Out, 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 out. <laughs> there are lots of explosions about to go on over there. Ah, okay. Here. Here are the explosions. Explosions. Ah, what? What activated? What activated the stupid... The, 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 what activated the, uh, the axes? How do I... Stop throwing explosives at me. I'm trying to get over to you. <laughs> okay, there you are. Please drop some health. Drop some health. No. Okay, well, we're right at like 223 again. It's, uh... Well, we're... Okay, yeah, we're kind of just right back where we started. <laughs> but we should be a little bit more powerful now, right? Just a little bit stronger than before. You, we, you know, we do have a little bit more health than last time, so it kind of works. Uh, let's go for um. Any health effects are more potent. Don't need that. Oh wait, restore 135 now. After you take damage, damage and completely chill your foe. Now wait, hey, don't I have a boon where when everybody's chill, when all foes are chill affected, they are 10% slower and decay. So if he hurts me, if if Hades, my father, hurts me, he's gonna get completely chilled and damaged. Or I can just go ahead and take some healing right now. Do I want more damage or do I want healing? More damage, healing. More damage, healing. Well, he's probably going to be hitting me a lot. <laughs> he's probably going to be hitting me a lot. So I'm going to take I'm going to take the frozen touch simply because he's going to be hitting me so many times. That's going to be a lot extra damage on him. Thus has the prince again persuaded fearsome Cerberus to get out of his way. Bye bye, Cerberus. Cerberus bribed. It is bribery. It is, it is it's bribery. It is 100% bribery. But all right, this is the final battle. Okay. I am I am prepared. We 
we will win this. I have never been so strong ever in any of my runs before. We are goaded right late, now. Father. You still have yet to see the sun itself. You know only the light of Ixion, but the sun, it is positively blinding, hideous. It has been snowy nightfall every single time now that you mention it. I didn't know it snowed so much up here. It hasn't always, but that's of no consequence to us. Especially when there's a raging battle to be fought. Ungod, Father. Hades, God of the Dead. Today, you've met your match, and I'll take you down with your own spear that you once held as your own, that you fought alongside with Poseidon, and I just took some damage. <laughs> I will take you out, use that backstab damage, keep my distance the best that I can, use my rift, he's about to strike on me, wait for it. Yeah, dodge out of the way, I have, like, what, five or four dodges? Use them to my advantage. There we go. They do have a shorter range, oh god, they, they home, they home. They have home seeking, oh god. Okay, he's summoning a whole bunch of enemies. I'm going to try to take these guys out as soon as I can. Take out the skulls on the ground, because those are just annoying. Dodge out of the way. <laughs> those are just annoying to have to deal with. I'm going to wait for him to come back. Yeah, wait for it. Wait for it. Dodge out of the way and activate my ability. Start doing more damage to him. Yes, yes. Do the rift as well. Stack up all those hits. Oh, he did hit me pretty good right there. But we're doing fine. Nice. Oh, look at that. He's already down below half. We are straight up go to. We got this. We got this. Take out all the enemies. He disappeared. Nice. It's like a really good time for him to disappear for us. Oh, and he still hits us. God, that homing skull is annoying. I tell you what. No, no, no. Dodge out of the way. <laughs> uh, he's about to hit us. Yep. Yep. There it is. Throw my rift. But look, he's getting chilled. He's getting chilled. I'm really glad I took that. That revenge chill is slowing down his attack speed and his movement speed with that. Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. Take out the skull in the back. Maybe I can take out this one. Dodge. Oh, I did manage to take it out. He's gonna hit me. Dodge out of the way. Throw my rift. I'm gonna keep on moving backwards. Let the doom do the work. Throw the rift. Throw the rift. Yes! Oh my god, okay. We still have two death of fighters left. We got this. Oh my god. You strike at your own father. What choice does that leave me? You struck at me first. You beat me, father, dad. Dad, you hit me all the time. I'm definitely not projecting right here. You hit me all the time. Okay, maybe just once I could win. Okay, let me see mom on the weekends. <laughs> oh God, we're on to the next phase. <laughs> oh, he let out of the wave. Okay, okay. Ah, whoa, whoa. <laughs> okay, he's he's a little bit more, uh, he's a little bit more uh, uh, attacky. You know, all of a sudden he's, uh, he's definitely coming after me. I'll tell you what. Uh, God, <laughs> don't mind me. Just uh, just staying, staying up behind this cover here. Why don't you? Ooh. Uh, okay, I'm gonna activate my call because stay behind the wall. Nice. It's just gonna keep on hitting them from a distance, maybe. Oh, there we go. There we go. Yeah, wall keeps kind of cooling down after using his ability. It's a good time to strike. I have one health left. I have one health left. Okay, okay, we, yeah, oh, no, that's gonna kill. <laughs> he didn't kill me with it. He missed. No, I didn't miss that. <laughs> I did not miss that, but look at that. I have 130 health now. Oh, come on. I have 130 health now, though, so that means that we are, honestly, I think we're good. I think we're good. Dodge this the best I can, best I can. Running out of words to say, just, I uh, use that. No, 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 no. Oh. <laughs> Nice try there, buddy. Oh, near miss. Near miss. Keep on throwing my rifts. Stay on top of them. Stay on top of them. Just stay on top of them. Okay, okay, okay. I have the greater call. Activate these stupid vases so I don't accidentally get hurt by them. Use my greater call and start doing damage. Take them out. Take them out. Take them out. Take them out. I don't even care if I go down again. Did we do it? Please don't be a third wave. Please don't be a third wave. you that I would father and I'm going to goodbye wait wait just if you if you find her if you somehow find her tell her something for me tell her tell her Cerberus is doing very well what 
Wait, I don't think I owe you any favors here. Now answer me one question and I'll give it some thought. How's that? I know your question, boy. But ask it anyway. Persephone, my mother, why did she leave? I... Blood and darkness. There is no escape. Uh, we, we did it. Oh my God. We actually freaking did it. What, what, what do we have after this? Okay, first of all, that took me 33 minutes as a clear time. New record. Okay, cool. Straight, great. Eternal Spear. Yeah, that, we had some great dish. I'm glad I went through all that. 24 health left. The ancient blood. Harafa shuddered just now. Harafa. Oh, the spear shuddered? Um. I'm. Okay, I'm just going to let this play out. And I'll see you after all the dialogue's done. I, I'm assuming there's going to be. I made it. Beyond the frozen overlook, await the first glimpse of the sun to your left, then onward through the cold. Sure hope this works, Nix. surface, windswept, racked by freezing cold, nonetheless instills within the prince a sense of awe and the sublime, for it is unlike anything that he has seen. It's beautiful. Is this a cat? Who's there? Um, hello? Hello indeed. Pray, who might you be wandering all the way out here? You're trespassing on private property, you know. Speak up. Um, you must be... Persephone, my name is Zagreus, and I think I might be your son. What? How dare! Get out of here! Get out, or I shall make you! Out with you! No, so then you are her. I, I don't care if you hate me, but I'm not leaving until I get some answers. I never even knew you existed. Why did you leave me? You died! You... you died. Those burning feet, they... sputtered out when you were born. But... now you're standing here before me. How? I died? I died? What, you mean permanently died? But I'm alive. Oh, gods. You never even knew I existed either. Alive? Sagrius, he... Even kept your name. You live. How can this be? You live. You live. Oh, the cruel fates. My son. Mother. Hey, 
In short, I beat him, finally, though he did everything he could to prevent our meeting here like this. But there's something he wanted me to tell you in the end. He said to tell you Cerberus is doing very well. Ah, uh, he told you that, did he? That's good. That's good. Though, tell me something, Zagreus. How is it that you found me? To have journeyed all this way, I scarce believe it. Zagreus? Uh, oh, it's... Guess I'm just a little tired, that's all. Not accustomed to the weather, as I think you call it. No. No, that isn't it. It's that... You cannot stay here. You can't stay here. Really, you're... <laughs> kicking me out? Why? The fates are cruel, Zagreus. You're bound to that place. The same as your father. So they would have us say goodbye. For now. My heart soars knowing you live. But then it breaks that our time together was so brief. No. I can... Come back. I can come back. Now that I found you, he... Maybe he'll just let me come back. You tell him I demand it. And I demand he also tell me how come he, or for that matter, Nyx, never sent notice that you lived. Olympus is all rife with schemers. But I was so naive to think that they were different. I'll tell him. I'll tell him. I feel awful. I... I have to go. The sticks shall take you then. Oh, Zagreus. Farewell, my son. Won't you come back to me? When you are able, please, come back. I shall be waiting here. However long it takes. However long it takes. <gasps> Can't hold on. Uh, mother, I have to get back there. Uh, well, uh, sorry, let me wipe away a tear or two from my own eye. I mean, look, I'm like, I'm a big, strong man. I, I'm, I'm a goofy goober sometimes and stuff makes me emotional. <laughs> she, th she thought my own mother thought I was dead. So Zagger's is supposed to not even be alive. Like, did I like die in the womb or whatever? And then like, like the father, Hades never told her. Hades never told per Persephone. But is there anyone here for me to get answers? It's finally returned. All you have to say? Hello? You are late, boy. Have you any idea what time it is? No. Wait, what? I vanquished you in single combat and finally found mother. And that's all you have to say to me. Nonsense. Don't you think I would recall such an event? You can't be serious. You're going to pretend as though it never happened. She wants answers, same as I do. She demands you let me pass. Let me go to her again. Silence. This discussion is over. I hardly think this is the time or place to indulge your overwrought imagination. I know where we can continue this discussion then. Uh, excuse me? Like, is he just plain dumb because he's sitting there at his chair in front of everybody? Doesn't want to know that there's actually a way out of, you know, out of, out of here. And yet you just have to, you know, beat Hades, the god of death. Simple, right? I mean, okay. So maybe he's, he's just plain dumb. Like, all right. Well, hang on. What does everyone else got to say? Where I'm just, I'm just going to go ahead and go through all the dialogue now because I am too invested into this to not just like listen to what they got to say at this point. It's awfully quiet here, you know, when you're out and about. It makes me a bit self-conscious, truth be told, seeing as ostensibly I'm the musician of this court. Look, if you decide to start strumming on that lyre again, I'm sure nobody here is going to mind. Though you take care, okay? If you insist, Child. my friend. But your father fell to you as once his father fell to him. Although you were substantially more merciful, 
I know it is a bitter victory at best. Though, tell me, what transpired subsequently that you have returned? Did you locate your birth mother? I did. I... she was there. She was where you said she'd be. And more than I imagined, but... I had so little time with her. I can't survive up there for very long. Why didn't you tell me I'd just die no matter what? Oh, my child. I say this seldomly, but... I did not know. Or I did not wish to believe. That the service would have such an effect on you. But it seems you share your father's fate, after all. My father's fate? But he is smugly waiting for me every single time I make it there, and seems quite healthy by then, all in all. Though, maybe the farther we get from this realm, the worse we get. Because he cast his lot, inheriting the underworld. So I now presume, you are bound to this realm by powers greater even than mine. Tell me something. If you knew that you could only see Persephone for but a moment's time, would you still make the journey to her there? Yes. Yes, I would. I had so many questions left for her. Then go and ask them, child. Steady your resolve and find her there again. And use well what brief time you have with one another whilst you can. As mortals do. As mortals do. I should visit the head chef. Zagreus, please tell me that the rumors are untrue. You really vanquished him. Have you completely lost your mind? You're going to destroy this blasted house. Come on, Meg. Father had it coming for some time. What's your concern besides? The house is safe. He's not going to take this lying down. He'll find some way to take it out on you, on all of us. You watch yourself or all of us will pay. I will not let that happen. <gasps> Please, make yourselves at home. I have to tell you, Dusa, your job seems really stressful here. It's a big house. You have to tend to the entire thing. Oh, well, most of it isn't so bad at all. But ever since Cerberus tore up the lounge, I guess it's been a little hectic getting everything back to normal like before. I'm not sure it was ever normal around here, but I'm sorry I created work for you. Cerberus tore the place apart because of me. Though maybe I can help you patch things up. Don't say that, Prince. Cerberus knows better, and besides, you have your job to do, don't you? And I have mine, and I will do my very best at it. Just wait and see. And she's off. Here's the catch of the day, or night. Always a pleasure. Hmm. I found her, sir. My mother, she's alive and well, and... Uh, but I just couldn't stay up there for very long. I have to get back to her. You really made it all the way? You must have gotten past your father. That's amazing, lad. But wait, what was she like? What happened to you there? She was... she was great. Nothing like father, more like you a little bit, I guess. Though being on the surface, it just seemed to suck the life right out of me even without the wretches of the underworld trying to do me in. But then you had a little time at least. That sounds like you have unfinished business with her there. You got to her this once. Surely you're able to again, isn't that right? It is. I have to speak with her. I, I tell you what, Dejeez, I am actually just blown away. Like there, for a roguelike game, it is phenomenal and just the fact that there can be so much story here so much background i know that they're using a lot of the greek mythology and like already lore and stories kind of written but like i i it's, it's amazing it leaves me always breathless because like there's it actually makes you want to play the game more not because like oh i want to play because it's a roguelike you want to play because you know that there's something more than just that there you know if there's something more to the story plus it's all voice acted as well it's not just text box you got to read yourself that people can easily just skip past i mean you can skip past this but like it's all voice act, so you know what they sound like. They're, they're story to tell. You can hear it. You can verbally listen to it and all that fun stuff. And honestly, I, again, I am, uh, you know, I, I love these games. I love roguelikes. It is what it is. But thank you, Digities. And hey, let me know down below. Leave a comment, okay? Before you click off the video, I'm like, all right, the video's done. Let me know down in the comments. If you guys have been watching for the better part of an entire hour, I mean, 
let you know let me know down in the comments do you guys want to see more hades what kind of new format would you like to see it more cut up would you see like to see maybe just like i don't know just the dialogue parts or something of the sort i don't know let me know down below what you guys would more enjoy but hey remember that uh i i don't know if i might make an up a quick update video just to remind people but i'm not going to be posting videos for an entire week if not even more i'm not going to be dealing i'm not going to be doing daily videos anymore for a short while i will return to it in about three four weeks or so maybe maybe a little bit after we'll see how the time frame all works because remember i'm working on the music video that's gonna be coming out i was talking about that earlier i also got the movie i want to be making and also want to do a video essay so i'm going to be pushing myself to really create something completely out of my comfort zones they could be absolute trash they could be pointless they could be great they could be fantastic they could skyrocket my channel somewhere they could also bomb my channel i mean honestly i don't really have that many subscribers to begin with but i'm very thankful for all of you who do watch and especially those of you who watch even further into these types of videos because god knows they're an investment of your time so thank you from the bottom of my heart and i will see you guys in the next video thank you and bye bye